Welcome to this video. In this video, I would like to show you the top SAP programs at all. So the most important SAP programs and how you can get access to them quite easily. So basically, what is an SAP program? So as you can see, the SAP GUI is the front end to execute different transactions. So within here, for example, if we execute the transaction code SE16N, to open up a data browser within here you can enter different tables and execute this and get to know the data behind this table so this se16n is of course one critical transaction code but i think a very very useful one and behind a transaction code there is most probably a program to execute the logic behind this so here we can see one example of over 150,000 um, examples of programs and transactions and not for every program there is a transaction behind but most probably you enter as shown the transaction code in the command field and then the program behind this will be opened up. What you also can do within the transaction code SE38 or with the transaction code SA38 so the our program execution you can also directly execute the program behind this transaction code to get to the transaction and to open it up and the whole SAP ecosystem and a lot of functionalities are built on top of a program so a program is most probably a tool that automatically execute a logic so to um, process a functionality to enter data to change data to delete data and to yeah to use the sap system at all so their programs play a fundamental role within the whole sap system as shown just a real um, um, learning or teaching of this within the ABAP editor, the shown transaction at E38, you can program the, um, so you can code the programs and within the SA38, you can just execute them and um, yeah, have a closer look about this. And as shown within the transaction SE93, you can um, maintain or you can also um, analyze transaction code. So there you can display and here you can see the program behind this. So this is how you can analyze what kind of program is behind this. So there are a huge amount of programs within the SAP system and I'm quite sure that you can't know every program by heart as you also can't know every transaction code and I am a really fan of area menus um, so one easy way to get to know uh, the most important and the top SAP programs is using an area menu like the area menu um, S000 so this is basically the default area menu that you can see within here to have easily and quickly an access to um, different transactions for accounting for financial accounting general ledger and so on and if you double click then you can execute the transaction for this as you can see within the s000 <coughs> there are most or very very important transactions um, for the different areas and one really useful area menu for the programs is sap1 so if you are in the start menu so not within a transaction within the start menu and you enter sap1 in the command field hit the enter key then you will enter the sap easy access so the area menu for the report selection and if you know for example open up financial accounting general ledger and here go a little bit down then you can see the programs behind this and if you double click then you can execute the program so also if you would do this with the sa38 so then you are and here it takes a couple of uh, seconds because there in the background there will be done a comparison so then you have your selection screen 
And yeah, this is, uh, especially within here, you can see the report name. <coughs> Uh, by the way, if this is not displayed for you, then under extras and settings, you can um, select the checkbox display technical names. Then the report name will be will be um, shown. The transaction name basically will be shown at the beginning. So and yeah, keep this in mind. SAP one and once again S 0 are two very important area menus to easily. Um, explore the top SAP programs. I'm quite sure that there are still a lot of very important programs that are not within this tree structure, but especially for um, beginners or people who would like to explore a different area, I think those two area menus are really useful to get to know um, more about different areas. So, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions left, please put them in the comment sections. See you in the next video.